one person who is already putting out action for 2017 is reggae dancehall star Felix Duke, who has already put out new materials this year after many years of break. So we rightly beam our spotlight on him today. Every day before you get along, Joanna, can't to see I'm your kind of man? Joanna, can't you see me that you're a Joanna, please, please, don't look another man. After many years of staying away from the studios, dance music star Felix Duke returns to mainstream on New Year's Day with the new single, General. Produced by Fast Rising producer Starry, who unfortunately passed away before the track was released, the High Life Influenced Dancehall track affirms Felix Duke's position in mainstream music. Um, what inspired the song was um, the years I put into the, into the music industry and um, I mean everything I've done so far and um, being a godfather because I know my onions in the industry. So I said, I'm a general. Because it's not easy to be in the industry for over almost 30 years and you're still, you're still relevant. So that's why I said, I'm a general. Having been working the Nigerian music circle for about three decades, Duke has over the years provided classic tracks that cut across trends of different times. His musical career is blighted by an occasional musical hiatus. I don't know how it happened. You know, most times I, I get caught up in, you know, maybe traveling here and there, doing shows here and there. And um, so far, I think that has helped me, you know. And uh, if, you, if, you, if you release an album or singles every year, and um, it, got to, it gets to a point where you, you don't make sense anymore. Before you know, you fade out. So I believe in, you know, it's, it's, it's good that I take time to do whatever I'm doing. And, and I've never done any album that has not been relevant. His track Baba Baba features former Plantation Boys lead singer Two Face Idibia and High Life crooner Sonny Neji. These two have gone ahead to ride the times and record successful music careers in their chosen genres. <laughs> When we started, the industry was, wasn't as vibrant as it is now. Um, back in the days, you play, you, you, were in, you just go into music for the love of it. Then as time goes on, money comes. You know, and um, why is it a bit different now? I'm sure because of um, uh, social media and, um, you know, so many TV stations in Nigeria, and most TV stations are, are, are on DSTV, and, um, and a lot of them, 
you know, uh, you know, went into the entertainment as, um, side of it, like, you know, music entertainment. And they know that's what they used to get the audience. And I think that's what has really helped the industry. You know, unlike when they have few TV stations and few radio stations and um, a few DJs, you know. And, you know, this, the industry has really grown, you know, to the point that uh, everywhere in the world now, uh, Nigerian music is, um, is making sense, you know. And um, due to the kind of music we play, Nigerians, they diversify a lot. They can hear any music and improve on, on the music, on the beats, and flow whatever they want to flow on it. And, and why the industry has really uh, become vibrant, I'm sure it's because um, there are more, you know, the youths, they take it more seriously and they, they, they look at the business aspect of it now because they are out to make money and they, they put in so much. His career spanned periods where reggae music was first the dominant force in mainstream and later the creation of raga music and dance hall. Over the years, the Nigerian mainstream music industry has grown to create a more dominant pop sound outside from hip-hop music. Being a predominantly reggae dance hall act, Felix Duke is optimistic that the music genre can be rekindled to regain its past glory. Reggae music is not, uh, cannot die. You understand what I'm saying? Because reggae music passes messages, positive messages, and um, is a genre of music that, that has come to stay. You know, when you say reggae music, you look at, I'm sure you're looking at the root reggae side of it. Uh, root reggae side of it, you see a lot of people still do the root reggae thing and meet up with the, with the time. And uh, there's reggae dancehall, which I do. If you listen to my, my, my old album, uh, 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 Joanna, that's, that's a dancehall uh, reggae beat which you can dance to. And that's what is happening. Now, if you, listen, if you listen to radio these days and listen to what is happening around the world, reggae dancehall is still the ending. It's, it's, it's coming stronger. It's was stronger. Oh, no, no.